How's it going, everyone? I am Jason, and we are back with Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games Tokyo 2020. So, if you see in the last video, which in my time, I based was just like a few minutes ago, we did some mini games that I that were supposed to be in the episode. You know, this is actually supposed to be episode five. But this is episode 4 because I'm an idiot. So, yeah, we played the mini games that were supposed to be on that file, so, yeah. And we also did some events as well. I'm, I'm just gonna go to a quick match. Like, we did events like, uh. We did Equestrian, I remember, but is there anything? I think we did Javelin Throw as well. I don't remember, but... Yeah. So, with that, Story we continue. At Chapter 14, The Flickering World. Wait, which were we? Oh, we're in the 8-bit world. Alright. Alright. It feels good to be back, but let's continue. Bye. I bet Bowser's still on the prowl for more miracle rolls. Let's find him so he can't power up. I think this is when we, um... Alright, you gotta say Sonic. We got no choice. We'll have to find the miracle rolls before they do. Sorry! Alright. Let's go to Tokyo 1964. Alright, Lake Sagami. Oh, this is the Komazawa Olympic Park. Is, this the, is that the only one left? It seems it's the only one left. Alright, Lake Sagami. Oh, there's Bowser. <laughs> what took you so long? While you were dawdling, I made my move. This miracle roll is mine. Ah, uh, no! You were too late. You two just sit back and watch me pop this miracle roll in my mouth. Pause. Here we go. Oh my god! <laughs> Bowser. Uh. Hmm. My miracle roll! Where'd you go? Too bad for you. A bird came along and snatched it. No! How could something like that happen to me? Bad luck gets us all, huh? <laughs> it's a lucky break for us. Uh, well, fine. Completely fine. One of those things will make a difference. Before you even got here, I already downed two miracle rolls. What? You ate two already? <laughs> There's no way you can win now. So, will you give up? Lost your will to keep struggling? Yeah, no way we're quitting. Two miracle rules should make things even. I'll take you on here. There's no gold medal for you here, pal. Hmm, big top. I'll take you on, but don't disappoint me with a pathetic showing. <laughs> Alright, so we gotta defeat Bowser in the kayak event and earn a gold medal. However, I gotta do something real quick, so we'll do that when we come back. Alright, I'm back. Let's continue. So, kayak, I don't know if I've played this yet. Huh. Oh, we have to road. We have to rotate this stick. Okay, this is, this is 
I never do trivia as well, but anyways. Humans have been using boats for thousands of years, ever since ancient times. But it wasn't until much later that canoeing became a popular sport. Do you know when that happened? No. 1865. That year, a Scottish lawyer paddled all over Europe in a canoe. And everyone saw it. It was a great way to exercise and have fun. Alright, what about this? How many times did Mario's eternal rival Bowser appear in his first game? I want to say eight. Oh, once. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I re yeah, never mind, never mind. Though he seemed to be the boss of all eight worlds, the first seven Bowsers were fake. 
the real Bowser only appears in the eighth and final world. Obviously, because there are eight worlds in the original Super Mario Brothers, so. Alright. National Stadium. Eat some miracle rolls? Ugh. I ate some, but I still came up short. Ugh. So they come again. Hey, how about you compete with us? Why not see how much stronger you've gotten? How impudent. Fine, I'll take you on. What? Me as you again? <laughs> Don't get any cute ideas just because you got lucky last time. I'll show you my new Im improved in power. So we gotta defeat Eggman in the 400 meters and earn the gold medal. Alright. I've done this one before. Uh, yeah, I've done this one before. You just gotta run, hold, charge power, and whatnot. All right, let's go, Eggman. Mario. <sighs> and the start was nailed. All right. Clear the hurdle easily. A perfect jump. Oh. That's a nice rhythm going. No oh gosh. One over. Good, but how's the pace? Ooh, okay. Nice! Let's go! One try, y'all. Let's go. Yet another gold medal slipped through my fingers. But this isn't the end. We'll have even more powerful items sent our way. Even more powerful items? Wow. We do we directly asked Eggman Nega for them. That's how. He should be watching the game. Hey, Eggman Nega! Are, are you seeing this? Send us better power-up items than the ones you sent before. Hey, are you watching? Hey! Hello? Hey, Eggman! The stream just now. It flickered. Uh-oh. What what's going on here? Hey, Eggman! What just happened? It can't be! I highly doubt it, but maybe. No. That must be it. Okay, what's happening? Yes. That's the one, that's the only plausible explanation. So spit it out. What's happening? This phenomenon. It's a sign that the battery for this game system is running out of power. And they're leaving it on a cliffhanger? Okay, I kind of like that. I like that a little bit. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's right! We need it because it was running out of power, I remember. Chapter 15, Cheer Power. I remember now, I remember. Alright. We got this after beating Larry at a question. Alright, let's continue. We have to charge up the excitement battery some more. Let's check out some other venues. Huh? Hey. I don't know if that was Tails or Pete saying that. But alright. I wonder. I want to see if we had any other characters, because I actually looked. It doesn't seem like any, we got any other new additions, because I did rewatch episode 3, or the last episode, I should say. And it seems like we didn't get any. So, alright. Ooh! Three pieces of trivia. Alright. Question individual. Horses have to get to the Olympic Games by flying there in a plane. When humans fly, they need a passport. Do you think a horse needs one? No? <laughs> yes, they do. 
A horse needs a passport to fly in a plane. Horse passports look different from humans. They contain information, in, important info like name, address, and what the horse looks like. That makes sense. Human athletes in the Olympic Games have to be old enough to compete. It's the same for the horses in an equestrian jumping event. How old is a horse to be? 20? Nine years old. At, at that age, a horse will have an ex, an, enough experience with a good jockey to complete all the parts of the complicated course in order. Guys, let me know, do horses, like dogs, in human ages, do horses have, like, human ages? So, like, what would be, like, the human age for, how old, what would 90 years be for dogs or something? Alright, what mark does Larry have on his head? A star? Yup. He has a giant blue star on the side of his left head. Look closely next to him, you'll see. I, that's what, exactly what I did. That's exactly what Right All right, Tokyo Stadium. Okay. Oh, this is rugby. Diddy Kong. Hey, but let's see what else is over here. Eh, you know what, whatever. It's Diddy Kong! Hey, Tails, I'm Luigi! Are you taking a rugby seven snatch? Diddy Kong. We're not here to watch. We want to play. Luigi! Yeah, I'm in an event too. Want to go up against each other? Oh, Wario. Yes, finally. It's time for me to win a gold medal. Ha ha ha. While I'm, while I'm at it, I'll wow the crowd and get them cheering louder than ever. We're counting on you, Wario. Drive the crowd wild and with great competition. We need to get them warm. Well, this is a team hey. event, so we'll be yeah. If you want to get the crowd into this, this event is perfect. You look like you're quick on your feet, but can you bring against a heavyweight like me? Let's see anyone try to tackle me. I'll have him bouncing off like a trampoline. Gwahaha. Alright, so we have Defeat Diddy Kong in Rugby Sevens. Y'all see me play Rugby Sevens? Let's go. Is it just gonna be Wario versus D Diddy Kong, or are there gonna be others on my team? Alright, wait, I already know how to play. Oh, it's all boom boom. Okay, interesting. So I wonder if we're gonna be playing soccer. How is this gonna fair? Right, right. Go. Oh, go Oreo. All right, and bam. See, I'm good at this event. I've played this event multiple times. <laughs> there we go. Alright, let's go. Ooh. Let's go! Y'all can't see me, but I'm like, let's just go. All right. There's in the banner. They actually have Diddy Kong's flag. Right. Uh oh. What the? Uh oh. Uh oh. Scrum. I rarely get these, but let's go. Uh, I got a button mash. Alright, let's go. 
I rarely get scrum, so I'm actually glad I actually got one on camera. Woo! See how Boom Boom just died? We gotta see that again. Look how Boom Boom just dies. Let's go, I like that. Alright. Alright, I think it's 21 to 0 now. Yep. Come on, Diddy Kong. I know you can do well. All of them are boom booms. I thought we would actually have people on our team. Uh oh. Oh, get it! Get him! Get it out of there! Got it. Oh, that was bad. <laughs> I'm sorry, though. That was very bad. But... Alright, let's go boom boom. Let's go boom boom. Nice. Alright, we gotta that a little bit. Bam! Alright. There we go. It's good! Another one? Un Aww. Oh, you get another one. Come on. There we go. 40 to 0. Right, come on, end it. Yep, yep. We destroyed them. Uh, oh, so, okay, that's how it works. So it's just gonna be like little by little. Our team lost, but it was still an awesome game. Yeah, ha, ha. listen to them roar. They're all cheering for me. They loved me. I'm not really sure about that, but they really felt the bad me. <laughs> really? There's another vendor, vendor nearby? I heard there's a big crowd inside a crowd there, too. Why not check it out? Yes. <laughs> Sounds good. Thanks. Luigi, let's motor. Let's motor. The excitement battery has been charged. And now Diddy Kong is playable in Rugby 7s. Alright. That, that was the best. But, uh, you should check out the other button. Alright. So what, is it going to be soccer next? That's my guess. Anyways, Rugby 7s. Have you ever have you ever seen a Rugby 7s field? It's 7 meters wide and 100 meters long. How does that compare to regular Rugby field? I don't know. They're the same size. Rugby 7s has the same field, but fewer players. That gives them more space to play. That's why Rugby 7s games are so fast and exciting. Alright, what part of body does Diddy Kong have, but not Donkey Kong? A tail? Hey, I guessed it. Diddy Kong has a tail. Donkey Kong doesn't. 
I mean, he does like have like a little bit of a tail if you look closely, but it's but it's actually where his behind is, so we don't want to get that far in. All right. Oh, it's just next door. Ma, Ma Musa Shino Forest Sports Park. Oh, it's badminton. Oh, hey, it's Knuckles and Shadow. My boys, let's go, my boys. Hey. Hey. Yo, Luigi and Tails. I heard some pretty crazy stuff is going on. Something about charging up some battery? <laughs> You're telling them you came here just to charge a battery? You heard right. If we don't charge this ba excitement battery, we can't save Sonic or Mario. So that's what this is about. I'm not interested in playing sports, but I can help make the com competition more exciting. <laughs> yeah. Batman is played here. With me and Shadow on the floor, that'll get you double the excitement. <laughs> well, who's gonna play? Oh, Peach and Yoshi? What? That's a combo. I'm down with that. If that's the case, there will be our opponents. <laughs> oh, now there's, now there's a tough looking pair. We can't let our guard down with these two. Hmm. Peach and Yoshi, huh? I don't hold back no matter who I face. Yeah, my, my shadow voice is getting different now. Show you our ultimate power. Of course, we'll give it our best too. All right, let's go. So we got to defeat Knuckles and Shadow in badminton doubles. I I played badminton singles, but I haven't played doubles. So just A to serve, move. Yeah, your character moves automatically and you tilt the the show cut. And the super gauges will just do a special. Alright, I've done, like I said, I've played badminton singles, but I haven't played doubles. That's why they're showing me the, uh, uh, controls. I wonder, is it different with, uh, doubles? Alright, okay, when, when both team members have super engaged, performing a super shot will activate a special sequence. Interesting! Okay, let's see this. Another event that I've only done singles for, but not doubles, is uh, fencing. I've done fencing for individual, but I haven't done fencing at team fencing yet. Dick. <laughs> alright, alright, he wants to hit me with the ball? Okay. Oh god, Shadow's making all these plays. There we go. Nice, Peach! Nice one! Alright, I think this is up to five. I, ma I imagine! Oh my good get the check! What? Uh-oh. Oh! Ah! Oh. Oh. We're still leading. It's fine. Now, yeah, yeah, whatever. I'm gonna wait until Yoshi has this so I because I kind of want to see what the super special would look like if it was double. Uh-oh. All tied up. Alright, let's go! I didn't even need to press the... R oh, Yoshi! Yoshi used it! Okay. Oh, it's match point time. Alright. So, okay, I get ya. I'm playing as only Peach. I thought I would control both Peach and Yoshi. Go, Yoshi. 
Uh-oh. Deuce. Oh, no! Oh, he got me. Oh, my battery's running low. Well. Alright. We need another Deuce Yoshi. Oh, we lost. Alright. We'll keep it. Nice! Alright. Oh god, Yoshi! Got him. And my battery is running low, guys, so... I do want to do more. Come on, Yoshi, you were there! Um, I want to do more. So I'm just going to take like, a little bit of a break and then I'll continue. Uh oh. Uh oh. Knock him back! Oh, Yoshi got hit. Use it! Or he used it though. Computer used it. Ha! We got nothing! Alright, go your sheep. Oh! Ooh! I deflected! I was, darn it, I wanted to use Sid Slip. Be like, now it's my turn. But Yoshi got it. Alright. Expect you guys to be that good. <laughs> if it were me alone, I would have won. <laughs> Luigi, the battery's filled up a lot more. It's almost there. <laughs> if there's anything I can do, just let. Just let me know. I'll leave the rest to you. Make sure you stay focused till the very end. So you're gonna join us? Huh? Oh yeah, by the way, Jet was looking around for Sonic at the Olympic Stadium. Oh boy, Jet. Jet, Jet was? I wonder why. Mm, no clue. Maybe they had a match lined up? He seemed pretty worked up. If you were going to see him, be careful. That's just great. We better head back to Olympic City and explain what's going on to Jet. Or we could just leave him there. I don't really care. Hey. Hey, that actually rhymed. That was completely unintentional. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Knuckles and Shadow have joined. The excitement battery has been charged. All right. Let's check them out. Uh, Shadow. A black hedgehog, that's racist, known as the ultimate life form. Created with an immor immortal body, he wields chaos emeralds to warp space and time. And Knuckles. A powerful echidna who lives on Angel Island as the lone guardian of the Master Emerald. I like how they keep bringing that up, but, you know, he's not there to protect it. Alright, badminton singles. Judges uses a lot of different hand signals in badminton. Do you know what the signal for when the judge can't see the shuttlecock? It's kind of strange. They cover their eyes with their hands. Judges need to make sure the shuttlecock lands inside court lines. 
If they don't, if they didn't see where it landed, they signal by covering their eyes. Oh. Badminton doubles. Um, badminton might be based on a much older sport that was played hundreds of years ago. Do you know the name of that old sport? Battle door and shuttlecock. What a long name. It is said the name Batman comes from a country estate of the same name located in Gloucester Shrine. Alright, wait, no information about them? Let's see. Oh, this must be it. Where does Nichols live? Angel Island. I, I, in my head I was thinking that. It's a floating island where he guards an enormous gem known as the Master Emerald. Where was Shadow born? The Ark. There's a... There is there there's a rumor that Shadow was born in a space colony called the Ark, but much about him is shrouded in mystery. I like how they're bringing in more from other Sonic games. That's it knows that they're they're still aware of this fact. I like that. All right, fine. Let's go face off against Jack. Now you're probably wondering, Jason, why are you saying like that? Well. Ever since, well, it's just because, ever since this scene... No! Respected Jack, all right. All because of this scene. Oh, you know. Huh? That's hot. I don't see anyone around. It is strange. We met him here earlier. Are you sure this is where you met him? Hey, what are you implying? Are you calling me a liar? That isn't what I meant. Hey, you lot. Oh, Jet. There's a football match to be played. We need a field cleared so we can get the game going. What? Oh, hey, Tails. Where is Sonic the Hedgehog? Yeah, what? He promised a penalty shootout in the football, but he hasn't shown up. Where is he? <laughs> so demanding. Huh? Got sucked into a game console? Come on, you expect me to believe that? No, really, but it's true. That's why we're charging up this excitement battery so we can save Sonic in the office. <laughs> hey, I know what. Instead of Sonic, I'll take you on. The crowd will be excited when they see me play. Well, if that's how it is, I'll settle for a shootout against you. But I'm gonna win. I'll show you who's the best athlete, or the better athlete. Heh, <laughs> we'll see about that. I'll prove it to you too. Alright, defeat Jet in the football penalty kick shootout. So I'm guessing this is just penalty kicks? If it's not a full game, then that's fine. I will probably have more room and footage. Alright, Knuckles and Jet. Well, I know we've already got payback in Sonic Riders, but let's just go. So you just gotta do this. I've played soccer before, so it is, it is, okay. All right, wait, actually, I wanna see, how is this? Uh, super shot, uh, okay. Oh, he got me. He got me. Alright. Alright, I want to try to change direction. Darn it! No, I do not want to lose to him. I do not want to lose to him.
Yes! In your face! In your face! That's what you get. Alright. <laughs> there we go. I, I want to know how to skip the shots. So no matter what, we win. Nothing but rotten luck today. There's no other way to explain this loss. Thought I, thought I was easy picking, didn't you? Still, it was a good sh shootout, and the excitement battery still went up. Hey, wow, that's a neat battery. That's how it gets charged, huh? Yeah. Looks like it needs just a little more for a full charge. Good luck with the next competition. Wow. I think this is one of the only times Jet is actually being nice. Thanks, but I think they've been to all the venues in Tokyo. We need to get entry passes to other venues. We're almost out of time. Alright, a second battery's been charged, and now we can play as Jet in football. Ooh, new chapter. Chapter 16, the time remaining. Well, I only have a little bit of time remaining because I'm taking a look at that battery. What the? What's going on here? Hey, Eggman, what just happened? All right, I know I'm putting a. I did put a warning up there, warning for people of flashing colors, but it's fine. This phenomenon, it's a sign that the battery of this game system is running out of power. It's been quite a while since we were sucked into this game. It shouldn't be a surprise that the battery is running low. Hey, hey, man, what happens to us when the battery dies? Ugh, well. So basically, if the so basically, if the power dies, we die. I, don't tell me we're stuck in this game system, as in we're, we're never return to the real world. You're not saying that, are you? No. You want the worst case scenario? When the battery runs out, every one of us here will vanish. Yup, so if the battery dies, we die. What? Is this your idea of a joke? My heart can't take it. Yeah, I agree with Bowser for once. Not funny, Doc. It's no joke. We got sucked into the game system after the game started. When the battery runs out, we all vanish. Correct, Mario. Like game data that hasn't been saved. When the battery runs out, we will simply cease to exist. Well, now the stakes are seriously real. We may not have much time left. Bowser, where are you going? I'm gonna try to win gold battles, no matter what. So at least we can go back. Hey now, this isn't the time for that. Will you quit your harping? You think I'm gonna let bygones be bygones and cozy up with you? Protag- you- you protagonists? No, I got fried. You worked with us before, you know. Eggman, we are winning those gold medals. We challenge you to a volleyball match. Did you say volleyball? Sorry, I checked my battery. Ah, uh, yes, yes, Bowser. Nice idea. A nice idea indeed. We enjoy a huge advantage in volleyball. In volleyball team action. There's not a minute left to lose. We shall be waiting at the volleyball venue. Don't check it out. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Just vanishing in this world's not 
World's not for this guy. No sir, no way Mario. We gotta accept their challenge. Gold medals are on the line. But, alright, I, you know what, I was gonna say, continue, but I think that'll be enough for today. So the 400 meters, the hurdles event is a race where athletes must jump over objects while running. These objects are called hurdles, which is what the race is named after. How tall in centimeters are the hurdles for men? 91.4 centimeters. Think that number is random? It's not. The sport once used an imperial system of measurement. So the, uh, the hurdles were set at 3 feet, which is exactly 91.4 centimeters. Alright. So, but alright guys, I think I'm going to end things off right here. I'm going to end things off right here. We got more characters, we played more events. However, time is running out for our heroes and villains. What's going to happen next? And will we be able to get there in time? What kind of question is that? Of course we will. But stay tuned. So thank you all for tuning in. Thank you all for watching. I, I wish to continue this more. But yeah. So thank you all for watching. And, and have a good day. Peace and love. Bye guys.